Hey guys, what is up? It's I'm Carnage, and today I'm back with a new series of uh, me showing you guys tutorials on building some uh, beautiful statues. Uh, they're really fun for me because it's awesome how I get to make it, and also it takes a lot of work because I have to remember all the dimensions, and I kind of gave you a sneak peek there when I wasn't supposed to. Uh, but yeah, so if you didn't see from that little glimpse, I'm going to be showing you how to build a panda statue. So let's get started. <music> So what you're going to be needing for this build is you're going to be needing white wool, black wool, blue wool, gray wool, and light gray wool. So let's get started. So I'm going to go ahead and move it over here. It's not going to be the same proportion, so I might as well just build it over here. Just so it doesn't look all weird if it's unproportional. So what you're going to do is you want to start off with some gray wool. And you want to place one gray wool, two white wool two gray wool, two white wool, and one gray wool. And then you want to place on the top a full layer of white wool and this is what you should have. Now, what you're going to do for the rest of this is you are just going to go up, you're going to go 10 black up. So an example would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And you want to do this all for the rest of the 7. So. Uh, yeah, this is going to be fast forward. Alright guys, so now what are you going to do for this is you're going to place three black wool and then you're going to place one black wool on the far left side of that block. Then you're going to do the same thing, come over here, place three wool and go onto the far right and place one, one wool one wool and then you're gonna place another one on the side of it and another one on this side so you should have like this type of t-shape then what you're going to want to do is fill in all this with white wool oh this is like gray wool I just noticed that place it with white wool there you go and now what you're going to want to do is you want to go all the way up eight times because what you're gonna do is the body is a 12 by 12 and right now you just did two of that and there still is three actually there's actually three up there so what are you going to do I think you're gonna go up seven so you're gonna go ahead and place that then you want to go up seven so uh, one two three four five six seven whoa step fine and you want to do that for the rest of the torso <laughs> okay now that you did that what are you going to, want to do is you are going to want to place you want to go two up and one to the left yeah and then you want to make over here and do the same thing two up and then on this time you're gonna to go to the right one then you're gonna fill in all this with white wool and do the same with that then you want to place one whole row of black wool and this is what it should look like so to make sure the dimensions are right you're going to want to start from here and make sure there's 12. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So, as you can tell, I messed up. So, let me go ahead and fix that right now. Uh, what I did is I probably made an extra white layer. So, I'll be back. <laughs> Alright guys, I am back, so if I did mess you up, I'm sorry, just do what I did. What I did is I just deleted one white layer, went one white layer down, and then I redid that. Is basically what I did. So now what we're going to do is we're going to move on to the arms. So what you want to do is you're going to want to align the layer up to this two center, go all the way to the side, and you want to place far out. One, two, three, four. And then you want to do just a whole other layer like that. And then, this is the easy part, then you just fill in the rest with black. So if you can't tell... This is an easy build because mostly everything's black and white and it's not like little details. It's just plain out blacks. There's like no extra gray or anything like that. So you're going to do the same thing over here. Head over here. Make sure it's lined up with that. Place four wool to the right. One, two, three, four. Then you want to make another row and then you want to fill up the rest of the row all the way up to this black with black wool. Simple. This is a simple build. This is why I chose to do it uh, for the first tutorial because it's a very simple. And these videos might be lengthy. It might be 20 to 40 minutes long. 
So it's definitely a lot of editing for me because I have to make sure I don't mess up like I just did there. So now we're done with this part. This is how it should look so far. So now what we're going to do is we are going to make it a 3D shape. So what you're going to want to do is you want to come over here and you want to extend it by three. One, two, three. And then you just want to go all the way line up to that gray wool. And then you want to do the same thing. Uh, go out by three. And then you want to place one another layer of white. It's just so it looks like the Minecraft statue. It doesn't just look like a 2D because it's not that cool. Now what you want to do is same thing. Go all the way up to here. So what I like to do is so to make sure you don't mess up. Is I just place one right here. One right here. And I'll go all three. And then I'll connect it right here. To make a like. It's going to be make a rectangles around the whole area. So you know not to go above that. So. Like I did there, I just did the dimension of the shape, and then what you're going to want to do is place it all the way up with some black wool, just like that. You want to do the same with all of it. Alright guys, that's it. Alright, so now what we're going to do is it's kind of the same thing like this part. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to place three like that go to the right side place three go all the way up to the second block and go two to the right do the same thing two to the left now what you're gonna do right here is you're going to place white wool then you're gonna replace it with light gray wool and then place the right wool right here then you're gonna place two more light gray wool on the right side and do the on the left side two more light gray wool and then you won't go on to do is fill this in with black and then you want to go on top of this black knot right here and place two light gray wool. And then you want to come out right here by two to make the 3D tail. Just like that. And that's how the side angle should be. So then what you're going to want to do is around here, you're going to do the same thing like last time. So I'm going to go ahead and fill it. You just want to fill all into white all the way up. So this time I won't mess up is just fill the right wall all the way up into this right wall right here and so I'll go ahead and mark connect it just like that do the same right here connect it to here this is basically like your guidance right here boom voila just like that then you're just gonna want to place all right wall against the whole back area to make the back all right now what now we're gonna move on to the next step It's just gonna be like that same thing so what I do is you want to go Two up, place one on the right, go to the far right, two up, one to the left, and then you're going to want to place another one whole black um, wool layer on top, just like that. Then you want to fill in the rest with some more white wool. Hopefully that music's not too loud, it might be, but there's going to be some more like actual NCS music in the background. So now we're done with that, and then what you're going to want to do is uh, just connect it just connect the black just like that and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna 3d the arms so this one's very simple all you got to do is just go out three one two three one two three connect it and then whole another whole layer of white and then you're just gonna fill it up you're not gonna have to fill this part in you're just gonna have to fill the outer layers just like that you don't have to place the inside just go all the way up with the black um so um, it can match up with the layer So just like that guys just fill in all the black very simple Then what you go on to do is you want to fill in that shoulder With all black and I forgot this on my other channel when I did statue tutorial just fill in the hands with white wool Because that's what I forgot to do uh, someone told me that uh, if I don't think they're subs to this channel But I want to thank them for that. So you're gonna do the same thing over here go out three go out three over here connect uh, fill in Go out one more layer just like that, and then you're just gonna go out with black. Alright, guys, now we are done with the back, and this is how it should look so far. This is like the 3D texture of it. And now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna move on to the head. So, for the head, you're gonna want to line up with this white wool just because it's all black, it's a little confusing. Place a whole row of eight wool just like that, and you want to extend it by two. Then for this one, what you're going to do is you're going to place two more on the left. Then go to the right and go three. And then for here, you're going to want to place some light gray wool just like that. And put black wool above it for the nose and the mouth. 
Then you want to fill in this with white and make a whole nother layer of white again. Then once you do that, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to place two, two to the right and fill it up with the layer. And then what you're going to want to do is do the same to this side, two, two, and then you're going to place one on the left and then one on the top just like that and do the same thing over here one on the right one on the top and place blue right here for the eyes then what you're going to do is just fill this with white then once you do that you're going to do another whole layer of white just like that then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to place two black wool up and one to the left same over here two black wool up one to the right then fill in the rest with white wool and that's it for the top part for the um the face like the front and then what you're going to, want to do is come out here and extend it by two one two do the same thing over here one two delete that block then you want to just connect it all like that and this is very simple then what you're going to do is fill this so i'll make a dimension all the way up here align it up with that do the same thing over here put it up line it up and then you just want to place this whole little like square with some white wool <laughs> And there you have it. You have your panda statue. So, <laughs> I am sorry guys. Like I said, this is all rusty. So, if you follow my rule, um, I'm going to show you how to fix it. Basically, what you want to do is just, basically just remove the eyes. Just remove the eyes so then you can delete the layer. What you're going to want to do is right here, you're going to go one, just delete that and make another four. Just like that. So you just line it up with here and then go to the far left to make the four and then go up right there. Then once you do that, you'll want to place the blue wool for the eyes. Then replace it with the white. Just like that. And then uh, just bring down the ears. Just like that. Just bring down the ears. Voila. And then just fill it in like that and then just delete uh, just break all this white wool and I'll see you guys when it's done and there you go guys that looks like that just like that whoa I think I just made it a little bit taller yeah it's just a little bit taller but that's not too bad I just noticed it's a little bit taller and what I forgot to do I just noticed down here is just fill it in with some white wool just like that and there you go you have yourself a panda stack and there you have it guys uh, this these are great just to put in your world to show off to your friends you making statues of animals or famous youtubers and also um, it's also just really great say you're building hunger games even I mean even though there's battle mode now but if you're still building hunger games uh, you can just go ahead and add this in your world if it's themed off of pandas or if it's themed off a of YouTuber. Uh, just do that. Uh, basically, these are perfect for your builds. And these are just really fun to make. Like I said, sorry for messing up. Uh, I just showed you how to fix your mistakes. If you do want to make it smaller, um, I'll see how to make it smaller. But yeah, or I messed up on that stats. You see, these are the things. You never know which ones you messed up on. But yeah, guys. Th it's been I'm Carnage here. If you guys are new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And turn on the notification bell so you know whenever I live stream or make a new video. And let's try to aim for 4 likes on this video. And I'll definitely make some more statue tutorials on Minecraft. Otherwise than that, it's been I'm Connor here. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.